Yeah, that sound good. Tell them break it down. I so Wendy's in your town. Don't forget the dollar sign. How that sound? Yeah, that sound good. Tell them get in line. Hold it down. Hold it down. Yo, yo, yo. What up, everybody? Justin Saunders here. And in this video, I wanted to just give you a quick rundown more importantly about who I am, how I got involved with what I do and how it can really benefit you. So for those of you that don't know much about me, as I mentioned earlier, the name's Justin Saunders and I run a couple online businesses. My main sources of income come from my digital marketing agency called New Age Media. And then also I do coaching as well, which is what I found to be one of my bigger passions in life is actually helping other entrepreneurs really gain freedom, financial freedom in their life by making money online. So before I even jump into any of that, let me just tell you the little backstory about how I got started in all of this. So back in college, I went to the University of Kentucky because I was a big basketball fan and wanted to just go to a school that was really good in basketball to support them and follow their journey. I kind of just to be honest with you just partied my whole college way my whole college career away um you know it was one of those things where looking back on it wish i would have spent a little bit more time chasing the money rather than the um the lifestyle the fun times but anyways it led me into um a friendship relationship at the time where um, one of the girls i was talking to actually convinced me to go into sales for this digital marketing agency called the odyssey and at the time the odyssey was selling print and digital ads to local businesses right this is right when digital started becoming a thing and during this position is really where i caught on and saw the trends of digital really moving forward so anyways during this position um like i said i was in kentucky lexington kentucky i would go knocking door to door some days it was 90 degrees and humid as almost as humid as Miami weather where I'm currently at right now. And then also sometimes it was 20 degrees snowing, freezing, where I'd be knocking door to door, pitching print and digital ads to local businesses. Started off really bad at sales, by the way. And as I started doing this, I had the right mentors, the right type of people around me and got really good at sales. So. I did that for about two years and realized that um, why make 10% of a commission when I could do, when I can make 100% when I could, if I could just figure out how to fulfill the back end. And that's exactly what I um, decided to transition into was going out and quitting, quitting that position to go start my own digital marketing agency. Once I started doing that, I realized that it was a lot harder than I thought. So I got a couple clients because naturally I was good at sales but couldn't fulfill on what I was promising these clients because at the time, if any of you guys know who Ty Lopez is, I bought into his course to learn how to do this. And it was one of those things where it was like, hey, go offer email marketing, Facebook management, Instagram management, Facebook ads, lead generation, posting, literally offer the entire world to these clients and somehow hope you'll perform. Well, that's what I did and I didn't perform. It was actually one of the most embarrassing things in the world, going back to the client and saying, well, hey, how, how'd it go? And the client saying, uh, yeah, we got, we got two people in and one of them was your grandpa. <laughs> one of the most embarrassing things ever, um, but it taught me a valuable lesson is that if you wanna learn something, you gotta find somebody that has that skill set and pay them to learn. So that's what I did. Um, there was a little bit of a mix in there where I kind of got discouraged and bounced around from, you know, doing a digital marketing agency to doing Shopify drop shipping, um, even tried real estate a little bit, but it was more of just like trying to figure out where I was supposed to be in life and figure out what I was doing. But once I did that, I, um, I finally figured out that back to the digital marketing space is where I belong because I knew how to do it all. I just had to find the right people to show me how to do the back end. That's what I did. So I got involved in some mentorships. People showed me the ropes, invested a lot of money, still to this day and still investing money. So I'm a big believer in that. And I learned how to run Facebook ads. And ever since that day, it's been something that honestly is probably like four or five years ago and running ads almost every day since then. And it's taught me a skill set that 
one of the first courses I ever bought into told me that would last the rest of my life. And I'll never forget because the course was terrible. It was, it was a terrible course. Um, it was one of the first ones I bought when I was leaving that job to go transition into this was if you could learn how to run Facebook ads and market, you'll be set for the rest of your life. And that's something that I've taken with me as I've gone through my entire life, which if you've caught up with me at all, you know, I've traveled literally for the past four years, bouncing around in a new location. I've been in three different houses or three different living situations in the past, what, like 12 months. I just moved from San Diego. I'm currently in Miami right now, which is beautiful. I love it here. Gonna be here for a while, but long story short, once I learned all of that, um, I started going out there and getting clients and it um, progressed pretty quickly, right? Got into, found the right people to teach me the right stuff. And here I am now, um, you know, I run a digital marketing agency. At the time of this current video, we specialize in helping solar owners find the right homeowners that wanna go solar. Um, basically, otherwise known as we run a lead generation agency for solar owners. Um, I also do other campaigns as well. Pretty big in the healthcare space. Um, ran, worked with over 100 chiropractors um, in my previously, pretty recently, but also a lot of other things as well. That's kind of like my main source of income. The next source of income is my coaching program, which is, to be honest with you, I find a lot more passion in because it's one of those things where you, I see like it actually help people out. And for me, that's ultimately what drives me. So I run a coaching program called High Ticket Freedom, where we help agency owners scale. Um, we, we help some people get started too. We've been really focused on at the time of this video, we're rebranding quite a bit and we've been really focused on helping agency owners scale. But in the past, we've helped a lot of agency owners really just get started and get their first client. Um, to this date, I think we're up to almost 250 entrepreneurs that we've helped make an, um, an impact and make money online. And to be honest with you, it's really what it all comes down to for me. Like, you know, at the end of the day, I have my income coming in. I have other sources of income as well. I have Airbnb properties. I have investing in real estate, stocks, Bitcoin. I have other things going for me right now, but like at the end of the day, what really drives me and is a full passion is like seeing impact of what I've learned and invested all my time and money into be able to help somebody else. And the other day, actually, it kind of just hit me again. Is we got a testimonial from one of our students that um, is a little bit newer to the space, but he sent the testimonial and it was something where we didn't ask for it or anything. It just came out of nowhere. It made me realize like this type of stuff, you know, when you don't have to ask for a testimonial and someone just goes out of their way to send you one, like that's the type of impact I've always wanted on people. So that's why I really love this whole coaching aspect of what I do. And more importantly, it's just everything's kind of come into play just because of what I told you guys a minute ago is like that one course told me if you can learn how to run ads in the simpler way, if you can learn how to market yourself or just market in general, you're gonna be set for the rest of your life. And I mean, that's played pretty true to me. So that's where I'm at now. I. I'm on Instagram. If you guys want to shoot me a follow, I'll leave a link down below. Um, see if we can get our new video editing team to come in here and plug it on this video because that'd be kind of cool. If so, I'll put it like right there. Let's see if that comes through. But that's kind of just a quick rundown about who Justin Saunders is. Um, if you follow me on Instagram or anything else, you know I'm really big into fitness. I'm really big into health. Um, and if you want to follow my journey, go ahead and Follow me online. Instagram's where I post all of my day-to-day -day stuff. So hope you guys liked this video. And if you did, make sure to hit the uh, subscribe button down below, the likes, because we're going to be coming out with quite a bit more content here moving forward. But with that being said, I will catch you guys in another video.